So here we've talked about how to create an array list and fill it with names or fill it with objects and iterate through the array list using a for each loop. Right? Um, just one thing I want to specify is that when you create an array list, it can only be filled with objects, only objects. Okay. Um, so now I want to talk about how you can iterate through the array list using a regular for loop. Okay. So we're going to say in i is equal to 0, i is less than, and we're going to say array list not dot length, right? This is how we do it when we're dealing with arrays. With array lists, we're going to say size, two parentheses. Right? So since the size or the number of elements in this array list is variable, right? It could be 3, it could be 5, it could be 5,000, and then shrink back down to 2 again. Since it's variable, um, we need to run a method in order to figure out what this size is. Right? Uh, alternatively, an array, it's static. So it's simply an instance variable called length that is created when you create the array object. Okay? So anyhow, we're going to say nameless, uh, I'm sorry, names.size, two parentheses. Now, if we want to print out each object in the names array list, we're going to say names, and we're going to use the get method. Right. Get wants a index. And so just like an array is indexed, so is an array list. Right. This one here is the zero element, the one element, the two element. Okay. So add adds on to the end of the array list. So here we have an empty array list. We add on to the end. That means Daniel is the first element in the array list. We add to the end. That means Bob is the next one, the one element. Then Tom is the next element, the two element. Okay, so when this for loop executes, names.size is going to return the number three, the number of elements in the names array list. And then i is going to iterate from zero, one, and two. So the first time this for loop iterates, it's going to print out names.get zero. So it's going to print out the Daniel. Then it's going to iterate again, and it's going to be names.get one, which is Bob. And then it's going to iterate again, it's going to be names.get two, which is Tom and then it's going to stop iterating because i becomes 3 and the for loop stops.